Hello, Hater Nation. It's me, Echo, from Steeler Nation. How are you today? I know you all woke up real happy because the Steelers lost. Oh, when well, my team didn't make it, so I can't root for Echo's team. <laughs> Let me tell you something. You can't be more proud of a team than the Pittsburgh Steelers. See? Upside down again. I keep doing that. You see how many championships we got? Look at them. You know, you could be upset for one or two hours and then life goes on. You know, and I got the Yankees coming up. They're going to win another World Series or two. The Steelers are going to win another two or three World uh, Super Bowls down the line. You can't take this stuff too seriously, man. You know, it's not good for the ticker. And while I got my ticker working really nice, I want to keep it that way. So now all you have been talking, la, 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 I like cheese. Oh, what do you like? I like Munster. Oh, I like cheddar. Oh, all that stuff. And I had to live with Paul in Long Island, okay, screaming in my ear about, oh, at opening kickoff. Are you kidding me? The game just started. Oh, your team sucks. Oh. So I had to deal with him, la, 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 in my ear. So you know, I went through hell this week, and not because of the game, because of him. In any case, it was nice uh, being able to play a postseason game in Cowboy Land. Oh, I wonder when the Cowboys are going to play a postseason game in Cowboy Land. <laughs> Probably not for a long time. <laughs> anyway, back to the seriousness. Uh, a couple of you want to bet me dinner. And, and by the way, the White Castle. I got to place the order ahead of time. So you got to let me know when you come into town. I'll get you a double burger. The cheese is going to cost 50 cents extra. I'll spring the 50 cents, but, you know, take it easy, okay? Don't don't ask for onion rings, too, or nothing like that, okay? Dinner, double burger should be enough. And, you know, a lot of you, I got no guts. You know, you don't cut your hair. We didn't even make that bet. You know, but I'm a man. You know, I'll step up. We were going to make the bet, but I didn't get your message until I got back home. So, uh, am I crazy enough to do something like that? Cut my hair over a stupid bed? <laughs> Look, Steelers Nation, all right? We don't, we don't bend over backwards for other people, all right? But, since I am a man of my words and I had to prove that I do have family jewels, maybe, would you like to reveal... My haircut, mommy? All right, my little daughter. I have my little beautiful assistant with me. Say hello. All right. You can take the towel off first. Nice and slow. Drum roll, please. Oh, look at that. Thank you, my lovely lady. Look at this. But you know what? It's not too bad. It's not too bad. And, you know, it's like in the West Side Story when Maria was singing and she goes, I feel pretty, oh, so pretty, feel the city can give me, who's a pretty girl in the middle there? Yeah, 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 yeah. You didn't think I could sing either, did you? Anyway, it's not a bad look for the summertime is coming. You know, it hit 40 degrees over here in New York today, so it's warming up, man. I was sweating today. Anyway. We'll see you around, and uh, Steelers will be back. You can guarantee that. Take care. Bye.